Corruption that is happening in Zimbabwe. And Panam Kukakavadzana, Kukuitika, Kukuti, Zanubiyov is pushing the sanction mandra to justify their illegalities and their illegal activities that they are carrying on around the country. And then they do not want to admit that they are corrupt. You ask the seasoned campaigners of anti-sanctions, like Anamati Nyarari, they don't answer you. They seem to acknowledge that Zimbabwe is a pandemic of corruption, but they are not willing to engage and address corruption. The biggest problem in Zimbabwe is sanction. The biggest problem in Zimbabwe is corruption. It is PF officials. Corruption in Zimbabwe. Let us revisit Will of Vow, Will of Get, Scandal. The Druid are quite a lot of money. At the dealership price, we are not at a higher premium in the public. So now as I got more, it's a motor car. It's got two hundred. Did you not think it's got Ghana and Sali Mugabe? Which has an, an effect. You could we know that was no longer able to sustain its operation because they were selling motor car it uh, cost cutting prices. So could you have a that sustain? And they were now forced to retrench and downscale the operation of Willowvow and Devon Engineering. Salamu Gabala in this amount of Ghana, like 400. And it was facilitated by the Minister of Industry and Commerce of that time. Could I acquire with a word you And Kalista Sindovu is a ZANU PF member. Kalista Sindovu, as he shandy done as a Garnana Morris Nyakumbo, Morris Nyakumbo, I know near Pakuti. Zanu PF and very good amount car it. So other quantity of facilitator Jonathan Kazura, as it was CEO of Air Zimbabwe, could attend a motor day for at 20, at no Tengesa in the public domain, at 20 times the profit. Jonathan Kazura of Zanu PF. Morris Nyakumbo facilitated the sale of vehicles to Semilev, where Semilev village. Semilive eyes on a thing at a higher premium. Tagati Pese Ponwana, Emerson Nangagua, Kanazan Pif, Unwana Murung. Semilive was one of the people who corrupted Will of Amat, the motor industries. And then Ram Gabin Bavita ended the Sandura Commission to investigate into the Will of Good scandal. Could you want to go to church? I think a church is good at my Will of Our Itanga Kukonera. And he discovered Mkadwa was the number one. Then he discovered Morit Nyagumbo was involved. Morit Nyagumbo was in the cold comfort of the poison. You then discover Opam Chinguru came back from the United States of America. He was in the United States. The Deputy Minister Adzoka. He was in the United States of America. He was in the United States of America. He was in the United States of America. He was in the United States. But right now, I'm a government. Opam Chinguri. Maurice Nyagumba got off. Frederick Shala, a minister of foreign affairs, Nas, I got door when I'm an Angago, who said a minister of foreign affairs, was implicated in Winova. And I got to get some more cards. I put a 15. Frederick Shala. And no Sankala. The same thing. Jacob Mudenda, the current Speaker of Parliament of Zimbabwe, was implicated in the Willow Gate scandal of having be very instrumental. Jacob Mudenda, I cannot behave like a car dealer. Could have a dealership as a Chandisa corruption, corrupt connection through Kalista Sindrov, now Maurice Nyakumbo. To tend to car like a dealership as a corrupt will of our motor, motor industry. Come on, Guadama. Jacob Mdenda was the biggest car dealer. Wagaida would will of our Igomir. 
dzinga mutumbuka something yakanotora marori maviri mexidis bands achinyepa kuti ndiye kunota kurisa mabin na mudenda baba vakati baba vangu varotakura marara kuhange nechikochikari ndirikudo marori mairi vakanzokaita kubatsirai baba manya mbavaenda kuhange vakanoti murikudere rori ndirikutengesa vakanzi eti uya nayo baba vaya nayo mbavano vasikuitengesera kumonaka vakata monya kugadzira mabin mbavaisa pamusoro mbavano itengesera hange vamudenda mpafa yomunhu but nas ndiye speaker of parliament Saka zvino zvokushamisha iri kana vamudenda vaka kuti sengenzo chabango zvese zvarotara zviri correct ivo vaka vakaundwa on the background of corruption namana ngagwa kudzoka kuzoita speak of parliament muna aka corrupt a company kusika yagwada mabhasi then nas ndiye muno muri ku expect a mimi kuti akupei justice again sengenzo chabango in parliament ndoko mudenda mpafa Solomon general mjuru something vakabuditsa marori mairi Bamjuru corruption yakaitika pa will of all 1989 amugaba kaita Sandura Commission Sandura Commission ikada my investigation and it said varume vanda taurara they corrupted will of all kusika yadona but nasi vashava ni is a foreign minister vakadzoka si vamudenda is a foreign minister vakadzoka si opa vamudenda ndi speak of parliament vari movement vakadzoka si Iyo vakaba opa mchinguri ari mamuhumende akadhoka sei semule vakasika pakufa asina kutongerwa mosai dodzi dzinga mutumbuka ndiye akoniswa moto nemba yakutengeswa ne corruption uyo ati mudzikuritsitsi imba vai Morris nyagumba vashura nina nyadzi dzinokunda rufu so kana tikudzati corruption ye mzimbabwe yakatanga kare iyo ndikadzika midzi munogona kufunga kuti aiwa tuda ku justify opposition aiwa inyaye kuti huori wakatanga kare ndi vamunanga gora dzosamba vadzi muna 1987 nasi ndo dziri kutonga nyika ye Zimbabwe mbavha dza 1987 ndo dziri kutonga mu Zimbabwe ndipo vachibika imwe mbavha huru ino ndikudata gure kudata gure mbaita company yake sakunda hold Sakunda mba ya tenga matresha reviews from RBZ ne gajge gajge one dollar e to one dollar. Ndo vaina mba ano tenge sa matresha reviews pa black market ne one dollar to five Zimbabwean dollars. Kureati kudata gureka naka tenga matresha reviews e to twenty million. Aga wana hundred million. Kureata aga ita profit e eight million on the black market aji tenge sa matresha reviews e to RBZ kuchipi sa nyika kurijisa value yenyika five times ndo dzakaita vataguri mari vamba vaitora mavainisa mundandela investment landela investment inotunga mirwa na Christopher Ford right na Joseph Bear na Obeich Munga mbava tendra dza mari vachimika ma invoice ene makuti badra chakati kwa kati tabadra chakati kusika mari iyo yabudira ku London kwa vakanotenga company yai only one ne ma British inond crow kulanda takati pano wana zanbe kuno wana ji ma british vakanotenga kambani yo kulanda ino ndi cro cro chisina dzikana nevanhu ndo vari dzwe bindura nike mine ndo vari dzwe freda rebecca gold mine vakatengesa those two mining companies kuna vataguri ei company yakauya nemari ya kudzoka nekuseri kwe doji baba morichas ino ndi sorted international sorted ndo yakazopuwa mari ndo ikaika tiko badara chi e cro kuti vatore freda rebecca mine nembindura ne command vatagure vachi ona 35% of those mine vamunanga gwane shamari dzavo vachi ona 65% of those mine there is a very descriptive um, document with leaked emails with leaked sms confirming transaction randri kutaura iri ino ndi the sender right maria gezwa ka muno zia here kuti muna 2018 Ara bizi kuti yaona tatsotwa yakafriza makamba na vataguri yakafriza takunda yakafriza landela yakafriza limola yakafriza uh, kuvimba mine vafriza ma asset avo but rakasara ronyura vama unfreeze vaudwa ndi visa za my dive who issued that instruction sakunda yakata corruption iri pachena vanotengesera uh, mari vaona pa ara bizi ku black market vakauya vatenga ma gold mine 
ne black market ara bizeti ka freezer zikanji visa iza maita izo zo izo kamba niyo zo zo maita izo zo 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 Zimbabwean corruption is now institutionalized to the extent that it appears to be a formal legal transaction that is happening. Yet, taro kuitwa umbafa. Mcharanga rafam mechanization program ya katuwa na namu kabi. Of which in 2018 order general akaburita report rakatara 82% of government expenditures yet irregularities. And farm mechanization one of one of those things. Where is Anufi if? Yeah, my op my where is Anna? My rights. I'm gonna tour Amari. My my judge, never judge. I'm gonna tour Amari for for program a farm organization to go on it a farming and did it. But not even a single cent of that facility was repaid back to the Arab desert. Reserve bank ka ungu jaga chema ka tikuwa chama ka tour a rumi ya. Mama nanga kwa mvua pina mpali amend. Nagadara utita ku abzo, but kwele diki Arabi zeti ke farm organization into the public. Magadja abzo, but kuisa ke minister of finance. First, no one is with my citizens. Ndo waga badra ji kwele diki farm organization. My citizens are ana ku benefit from that initiative. My citizens are ana chaka wana ku papa farm organization. But Maria Gatorwa is na ku tosiru wa ni wanu wa ni marikari. Yaka badar wa ni ma citizens, ma taxpayers, they paid the price of farm mechanization program. Institutionalized corruption. Yaka itika mzimbabwe. Mungu mba abunza. Agad, which are illegal companies? Ma companies are ku, are ku, are ku, mzimbabwe. Kade Savannah, Savannah to bago kamban. Yaba Adam Molai, agaro ora mzukuru wa mkabe. Is, you know, Gadzara Pacific, the Remington Gold. But the outdoor in Zimbabwe, do not move down the bridge up. A bit bridge, do not think it's called the black market in South Africa. You will never find Pacific and Remington gold in a formal shop in South Africa. You find them in a black market shop in South Africa. But no pinda ziri kunze kwe mtemo. So that's not real. This is a good one more liar about the red text to Zimbabwe. One more liar about the red text to South Africa. But you've got a cigarette manufacturing company in Zimbabwe. You can manufacture food, but this could turn this kwa ziri pa mtemo. Drugu in the black market. Institutionalized corruption. Worry. Waka enda ku private school. 